Anna Nicole Smith is perhaps one of the most iconic and enigmatic figures of our time. Raised in Texas, she embarked on a tumultuous journey that eventually led her to the spotlight. Initially working as a waitress, her life transformed when she appeared on the cover of Playboy magazine in 1992, catapulting her to international fame as a guest model. Her vivacious persona, coupled with her hourglass figure and blonde bombshell looks, captured the public's attention. Her life became a media sensation marked by her marriage to oil tycoon J. Howard Marshall. She also faced personal struggles, including battles with substance abuse and the tragic loss of her son. Facts First presents Anna Nicole Smith was gorgeous. She died tragically broke. Early Life and Career Anna Nicole Smith's early life was marked by humble beginnings and a relentless pursuit of a dream that would eventually thrust her into the glitzy world of fashion and entertainment. Born Vicki Lynn Hogan on November 28, 1967 in Mexia, Texas, she navigated a challenging upbringing. Her parents divorced when she was young, leading to her mother's remarriage and a move to Houston where she went to high school. Struggling financially, Vicki dropped out of school at 14 and worked various jobs to support herself. Fate intervened when she met Billy Wayne Smith, whom she married at 17, giving birth to her son Daniel a year later. Despite the joys of motherhood, Vicky faced hardships as her marriage dissolved, leaving her a single mother at 20. Her life changed drastically when she landed a job as a dancer at a Houston strip club where she adopted the stage name Anna Nicole Smith. Fate smiled upon her when she caught the eye of octogenarian oil magnate J. Howard Marshall, whom she met while working at the club. Their connection grew, leading to a whirlwind romance and marriage in 1994, a year before Marshall's death. But Anna Nicole's pivotal moment arrived in 1992 when she became the face of Guess Jeans. Her voluptuous figure, sultry looks, and effervescent personality made her a natural fit for the fashion world. Her appearance on the cover of Playboy magazine further propelled her into the limelight, captivating audiences worldwide and solidifying her status as a sex symbol of the 90s. Capitalizing on her newfound fame, Smith delved into acting, making cameo appearances in films like The Hudsucker Proxy and Naked Gun 33 and a Third, The Final Insult. Her larger-than-life persona earned her a reality TV show, The Anna Nicole Show, which chronicled her life and antics, further solidifying her place in popular culture. Despite her rising star, Anna Nicole Smith faced a tumultuous personal life. Her marriage to Marshall sparked intense legal battles over his estate, catapulting her into prolonged legal disputes that continued even after his passing. Her life off-camera was fraught with struggles, including battles with substance abuse and the tragic loss of her son Daniel in 2006 due to an accidental drug overdose. Anna Nicole Smith's career was marked by both triumphs and tribulations. Her ability to garner attention with her captivating charm and larger-than-life persona cemented her as a cultural icon. But behind the glitz and glamour lay a woman grappling with personal demons, navigating the complexities of fame, fortune, and the relentless scrutiny of the public eye. Anna and J. Howard Marshall Let's dig a bit deeper into Anna Nicole's most controversial relationship. Anna Nicole Smith's marriage to J. Howard Marshall, an oil tycoon nearly six decades her senior, remains one of the most contentious and scrutinized aspects of her life. Their relationship was a whirlwind union that drew both fascination and controversy, shrouded in allegations of ulterior motives and legal battles that continued long after Marshall's passing. Their paths crossed when Anna Nicole was working as a dancer at a Houston strip club that we mentioned earlier. The two struck up an unlikely connection, leading to a rapid courtship and eventual marriage in 1994. With a substantial age gap between them, their union was met with widespread skepticism and speculation about Anna Nicole's intentions. At the center of the controversy surrounding their marriage was the wealth of J. Howard Marshall. Anna Nicole's critics accused her of marrying him for financial gain, insinuating that she looked to secure a portion of his vast estate. The legal battle that ensued after Marshall's death was marked by a protracted court case as Anna Nicole fought for a share of his fortune, pitting her against Marshall's family and estate. The complexities of their relationship were further mired in legal disputes and public scrutiny. Despite Anna Nicole's claims of genuine affection for Marshall, their marriage became a focal point of tabloid fodder and legal wrangling. 
The ensuing legal battles over Marshall's estate continued for years, with conflicting testimonies and a heated debate over whether Anna Nicole was entitled to a portion of his wealth. Amidst these controversies, Anna Nicole Smith faced personal struggles that compounded the challenges in her life. Battling accusations of gold digging and grappling with the loss of privacy due to the public nature of the legal dispute, she also endured personal hardships. Her battles with substance abuse were well documented, adding layers of complexity to her public image and personal life. Tragically, the tumultuous nature of Anna Nicole's life was further compounded by the loss of her beloved son Daniel in 2006. His sudden death due to an accidental drug overdose sent shockwaves through her world, plunging her deeper into emotional turmoil and grief. The legal saga surrounding her marriage to J. Howard Marshall persisted even after her passing. The battles over his estate continued with ongoing debates and appeals. Anna Nicole Smith was gorgeous. She died tragically broke. Anna Nicole Smith's tragic and sudden death on February 8, 2007, at age 39, shocked the world. She was discovered unresponsive in a Florida hotel room and pronounced dead on arrival at a nearby hospital. The cause of death was an accidental overdose. This came from her regular use of prescription drugs. Despite the controversies and personal struggles that defined her life, she left a complex and lasting legacy. She was celebrated for her striking beauty, captivating charm, and larger-than-life persona that made her a pop culture icon of the 90s. In the years following her death, her legacy has been revisited through various media platforms. The release of documentaries and biographical works aimed to shed light on the complexities of her life, portraying her not just as a celebrity but a multifaceted person who faced challenges and triumphs. The documentary, Anna Nicole Smith, You Don't Know Me, was accused by some critics of actually being sensationalist in and of itself. We'll leave that up to you to decide, but it's true that almost every depiction of her life and career have been sensationalist. Through these retrospectives and documentaries, her legacy endures, serving as a reminder of the complexities that come with fame and the human side of celebrity. Her life, marked by both triumphs and tribulations, continues to captivate audiences and provoke discussions about the price of stardom and the enduring impact of one person's journey through the highs and lows of public life. Now it's time to hear from you. What's your favorite memory of Anna Nicole Smith? Let us know in the comments section below.